Hey guys, I'm glad you actually came to watch this video. We're going to be talking about complex numbers here. And this i, this imaginary number i. We all know that i is equal to the square root of negative 1. And if we don't, now we know, okay? i is equal to the square root of negative 1. Perfect. So what we have is we have complex numbers, and this is the standard form for complex numbers. Now if you guys have been watching my videos, you know that I'm not really a big fan of seen examples where books or notes or anything talks about something like this a plus bi because honestly I'm pretty good at math and it confuses me still so I like to actually see numbers so let me give you an idea of what a complex number looks like 2 plus 5i that would be a complex number and this is what's considered standard form so I couldn't write 5i plus 2. That does, it just looks funny, doesn't it? It always has to be the real number, or this number right here, plus or minus the imaginary number, the, the 5i or something i. So we could even have it as 3 minus 2i. But we can't do negative 2i plus 3. just doesn't work, guys. So these are what's considered your standard form of complex numbers. So standard form is basically telling us that we're going to have the real number plus or minus the number with the imaginary. So basically the 5i or the 2i. And that's the thing that you're going to want to remember. So let me give you another example. What if we did, uh, tell me if this is right or wrong. 8i plus 7. If you said that this is wrong, you're correct. It's actually 7 plus 8i. So that's wrong. This is correct again. And that's what you want to know when we're talking about standard form with complex numbers.